What's up guys, welcome back to our classic zombie series where I go back and play all the zombies games and maps that I've missed out on. And we finally graduated to BO3 and today we're gonna be playing Shadows of Evil for the very first time. And we're playing Shadows of Evil because I did a vote in my Discord where the members there got to pick what map we play and I think we're gonna continue to do that for BO3. If you guys want to have a, a say in what map we're playing, go ahead, hop in the Discord and put your vote in there. But here we are on BO3. Uh, technically, this isn't the first time I've played BO3. Uh, back in October, I played uh, Poop of the Dead with uh, Silky, Left, and Lego. But I haven't played any of the official maps for this game. I know there's like gobble gums and things like that. It says I have a few here. But also it says we have Dr. Monty's Factory here. What is this? Season pass bonus as a token of our appreciation. Blah, 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 blah. Lots of words. We get one weapon bribe. I don't know what any of this is. Liquid divinium. Okay, well, I got 50 liquid divinium. I, I guess we'll use it. Oh, we can use cod points to buy more. Okay, well, let's do this. We'll get a 50% off pack. Okay, I don't know what this is. Crawl space, power boost. I don't know what any of these are. These look like the candy from Jimmy Neutron. Dead of nuclear winter. What the... What does this mean? There's so much to do here. You guys are gonna have to tell me what gobble guns I need to look for. This is this is way too much information to start out on. But the splash screen for Shadows of Evil looks sick. Let's go ahead and hop in and see what the map's like. Oh wait, cutscene. I know I yelled at you real bad. Okay, this is getting horny right at the start. I mean, they know about my dancing, but and cuffs. All right, I don't know how much of that cutscene I can show you, but here we are on Shadows of Evil. What is this? Become the beast? Oh well, I actually am a beast. What does this do? Grapple, fire, electricity. What do I have to do? Melee? Oh, I can break the door open. There's double points in here. Uh, let's electrocute that. Quick revive is on. Um, what else can I do? Okay, now I'm no longer the beast. I've been so excited to play this game. Well, like I mentioned before, I, I played a little custom zombies and I don't want to get back into it till I've played every like official map for this game. But that's like the main goal. I want to get through all of this so I can be able to play Poop of the Dead again. But this map gives me like Borderlands vibes. Like all the text just reminds me of uh, what was that place called? Aperture? No, that's Portal. Rapture close enough but for those of you that are new to the series uh normally i go through blind my first two like runs of the game and then i'll go ahead and like watch a guide and figure out how to get like set up and everything so the this is like my very first time touching this map ever let me grab quick revive real quick and then i'm gonna grab these double points next round and we'll get this going hopefully this isn't too much like mob the one thing i didn't like about mob of the dead was just having to turn on power like in the weirdest way and individually for everything this definitely has a way different feel from any other zombies map i've played so far though it has like its own like soundtrack and it dropped the double points right after i picked it up love to see it oh and a nuke what's up with all the power-ups all right all the zombies are gone can i buy this i can what's out here nice little market where this little piggy's going the alcar 9 i don't know what any of these guns are i didn't play too much bo3 oh there's a gobble gun station here first one's free what do we got arms grace I don't know what that is. Auto activates when respawned. Respawn with your guns. Okay. Speaking of a gun, I should probably find one. What is this? The Shiva? All right. I'll try it out. Oh, is this like their M1 Grand? Kind of seems like it. Okay. Let me try to figure out where the hell to go. I'm so lost. I've just been bombarded with information. I have no idea what's happening. Okay, we got uh, stamina up over here. If I become the beast, I can turn it on. So it does look like it's going to be like Mob of the Dead. Uh-oh. 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 That's fun. The meat wagon. That's what these are called? <laughs> are these like the Mustang and the Sallys? All right. What's this way? Down a nice little alley with whatever the hell this is. Oh, it's a trap. Another area to become the beast. But what do I power on over here? There's more gobble gums. Another alleyway. Ow. Zombie. Dumbass zombie. Oh, there goes quick revive again. I'm so lost. I'm just trying to roam around, trying to discover things. The zombie does not want me to do that. What's going on? Oh, what the fuck? Is this dog round? Flying, spitting bat round? What the fuck? Uh-uh. Nope. You need to go to sleep. Night, night. Bedtime. And perfect. Our max ammo spawns up there. That's useful. Hey, let me grab quick revive for probably the last time. How the hell am I supposed to get that? We have a civil protector. Oh, that looks like the origins logo. What's this way? I can become the beast again. There's another gun right here. The Cuda. I don't know what anything is in this. It's just me wandering around saying, what is this? I have no idea. Let's check up here. Another area where I can become the beast, but this looks more official. What's up these stairs? Uh oh, I'm broke and I'm down again. This is not going good. Oh my Lanta. That's a lot of zombies. And they're all here for me. Guess what? Eat an aid. Oh, an insta-kill? Perfect. Just what I needed. All of our standing zombies dead. Looks like it. Got a few crawlers now. All right. First thing I need to do, find ammo or a new gun. Let's just grab this. What is this? Looks like an automatic weapon. Uh, that looks fun. Looks like a fun time in here. Who the hell is that? There's a dude standing right there. And there's zombies hitting me. 
and the game's over. Okay, well, I can't stare into windows, apparently. This map looks so cool. Can I get in this water? Should I do it? I'm going in. Okay, it's fine. It's not even like... Well, I guess it is ankle deep. Oh, mystery box. Okay, I'll save for the mystery box. Actually, I don't need to save. I can buy it right now. That looks gross. What? Okay. I can't escape bad mystery box luck in any game. I always just get like rocket launchers. So that's cool. What a waste of money. Oh yeah, real, real nice here. We got cream cakes next to the erotic store. Yeah, we all know what's in those. Don't try to pretend. Okay, the rocket launcher is not that bad. It shoots really, really fast. Let's try being the beast. Get that out of here. Oh, it's Cthulhu sitting in a chair. I can grapple. What? So that's how I could have got my thing. That's ridiculous. What is this? What do I do here? Okay, that seems like something up there. No idea what that is. This is going to take so much practice on this map. I'm going to be playing this all day. Widow's Wine. I haven't seen that before. What does that do? Widow Wine's 4,000. Okay, that better do something good for 4,000. What's shaking? Why is the ground shaking? My controller's shaking. What the fuck is that? Uh-oh. And I went down. Great. I saw a big monster, got scared, and got hit. What the hell are you? All I know is I gotta shoot you. Death machine, perfect for this fucking thing. Get lit up. Oh! Is it dead? Did I kill it? No. No. I don't know why I'm running up here. There's no escape. Oh, we killed it. Oh, it's a Margwa. That's what those things are. Okay. Everyone was comparing the abominations to those. Oh, get the hell out of here, you flying little fuck. And we have enough for Widow's Wine. Might as well grab that. What does this do? Damn, what the hell was that? You just came on me? Oh, is that what Widow's Wine is? I just wrapped it up like a spider. Okay. So Widow's Wine has come. We figured that out. Ooh, what is that? I just picked up a spider on the ground. What? What does that mean? There's another spider power up. What is this? What does that do? I'm dead. I will never know, I guess. Well... It looks like I need to go look at a guide because I have no idea what the hell's going on, but this map's pretty cool so far. So I'll see you guys when I have a little bit more knowledge. All right, we're back. I think I know this map now. I've been playing it a little bit. I think I know it pretty well, but I also learned a bit about uh, gobble gums. Uh, right here is my gobble gum pack. I threw in two of the fun ones, the eye candy and tone death, just because I think they're hilarious. But I also have like anywhere but here in plain sight. And I have crawl space too, just in case you need any crawlers. Uh, I think that'd be kind of fun to use. Uh, gobble gums gonna be a lot of fun to learn them all I'm, I'm just really excited to be playing this game i just want to be able to get into everything that it has to offer there's so much let's turn on that open this up so what we're gonna do is i'm gonna try to get the wonder weapon and a sword and i'm gonna try to upgrade that sword so hopefully we can get that all done i did one run that i recorded of me doing this i died before i could fully upgrade the sword so i'm just doing it again let's grab our free gobble gum what we got oh eye candy nice fun one right to start let's use it right now look at these blue ass zombies oh we should probably grab our summoning key too let's change the colors up i want to get blue here there we go okay which one has jug that one's speed cola and jug is right here so i'll open that in a minute but really quick i need to address something this game is inappropriate as hell like are you kidding me anal district come on Grow up. All right, let's work our way over here. Wake our ass up, because we're about to go beast mode. Grapple on up, turn that on. Break Cthulhu out. Also should probably turn Jug on. That's probably useful. Let's grapple up, grapple over. Break this thing down. No! Oh, we're too slow. Big rip. Oh, we have another gobble gum. Let's get it. What do we got? Oh, tone death. Auto activates when killing a zombie. Slay sounds play when they're killed. So now, instead of uh, the craziest like visuals we're getting, it's gonna be all audio. I'm gonna need to buy a gun here soon. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Just for falling over. <laughs> I'm a child. No way a little donk just got me. I wonder what happens if I kill a bunch at the same time. Let's try to nade this group. Enjoy. Let's throw two down. Why not? <laughs> this is so stupid. I'm going to go wake my ass up and become beast mode again. So I can grab that part up there and open up the rift. Bust down, Tatiana. Break this open. And I think we're good on this area. The championship belt. All right, our gobblegums almost run out. Let's see if we can get something different here. Plain sight. Let's go. We gotta go beast mode again. We go over here. Smack this open. What's up, Shadow Man? Let's give him a kiss. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, and let's head on down. Might as well just do our ritual. First, let's get these zombies out of here. I hate this area of the map. It is like impossible to train at. And there's actually camos in this for zombies. I I, I found out. Pretty cool. Might have to grind some. Oh shit, there's a lot in here. There we go. Good thing it ended when it did. 
a carpenter. I'm grabbing this. Give me the wormy. This map seems so complicated when I started it. And now it's like, it's pretty fun now that I know what to do. I feel like that's like every zombie's map though. It feels like so much like there's a huge task ahead of just trying to learn the map. And then once you get it, it's fun. Oh, I never grabbed the fountain pen from here. I guess we can go do this trial real quick. Oh, I forgot about these guys spawning. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Let's throw it down and start the ritual. Get fucked, zombies. Get out of here. Uh-oh. Now I'm out of ammo. That's fun. Unless I can just survive. Yeah, we can just survive. Give me the worm, please. You're a little wormy. Oh, yeah. I forgot after the second one of Margwa spawns. Shit. I need ammo. Margwa, you have to wait up there, mister. Okay, let's turn on double tap. Make sure these stairs are on. And let's jump across and get our part. All right, zombies. Who wants to give me money? Oh, Margwa. What's going on, pal? Well, I got you here, Margwa. Smile for the camera. Smile for the thumbnail. Zombie, you're in the shot. Okay. Margwa, smile. There you go. Look at those pearly whites. Actually, if I have enough money, I'm opening this up, and I'm going to get the thumbnail over here. Look at you go, mister. Yep. Open those teeth. Beautiful. Hopefully that's good enough for a thumbnail. Oh, wait. This would be good right here. Smile. Yeah. Okay. I got my shot. I need to go back and grab one of the shield parts, and I forgot to grab one at the other place, so I need to go all the way back and get the rocket shield. There's one part. All right. Now you can get shot in your mouth idiot there we go that's two heads open up open your mouth open your mouth please uh oh this is not where i want to be barely survived that area that's scary margua please sit down i'm out of ammo dude there we go jeez give me your heart i have enough money to get in what oh i need to turn on the power with the beast mode thing let's grapple on up shock that all right let's head on in and there we go ritual's over give me my wormy come here little guy we got one more to go all right now Watch yourself. We're heading into the anal district. Let's smack the box open so we can grab the badge. I think we got this whole area opened up besides this Cthulhu box. Grab our badge. And now let's go in here and do our ritual. Where's the table at up top? Uh oh, of course. I'm out of ammo again. The second I start the ritual, I'll probably check my ammo before I start these things. But there's actually so much room to train in here. It's not that bad. There we go. Ritual's over. Bring me my worm. Come here, little guy. And now we got a Margwa spawning. I need to go grab ammo. Now we have all the worms. We can open up Pack a Punch. And we also go grab Widow's Wine, but we need to save up a little money. What's up, Margwa? Look at your head pops. There you go. All right, one more dome for you. There you go. Open that mouth up. Easy. Hey, drop some ectoplasm or whatever that part's called. Nope. Let's open up the rift and head on in. Let's pick up Widow's Wine real quick. 4K for it, but it's definitely worth it. Really fun perk. Now I'm going to grind up points till I can pack a punch. And apparently you can pack a punch twice in this. The first time, you know, you get normal pack a punch. Second time, you'll get a random like ammo mod, which is pretty cool. We might as well at least go in and set up pack a punch, even though we don't have enough yet. Let me through, please. The wall's gone. Thank you. Let's throw down. Oh, time's not right yet. Whatever, dude. Put a little wormy in. Put another wormy in. Oh, we got the really pulley olies coming in. Let me take these guys out real quick. Maybe I'll have enough points to pack a punch after. And we can do a little wall run right here. Nasty. I don't know when or what COD game had wall running in it, but do you think this was testing for it? I can't remember the timeline of CODs, but let's go ahead, throw down the rift stone. And once we kill like two more zombies, we'll have enough to pack a punch. But this is probably one of the coolest pack a punch areas I've ever seen. Just the whole ceremony of this. It's just so sick. So much went into this. And it's not just like a pack a punch machine. It's like a whole rift and the tentacle comes out and grabs your thing. The apocalypse event is what it's called. Let's just pack a punch our CUDA. All right, there's our pack a punch CUDA. Let's grab this. Put the death machine to work real quick while we have it. That's just free points for us. Oh, is that a Margwa spawning in? Come here, buddy. I got a death machine for you. Okay, you just teleported. Get fucked. Open your goddamn mouth. There you go. Take a seat. Oh, and then he dropped another death machine. Love to see it. All right, now let's work on getting, uh, we can get our wonder weapon and our sword, but we need to go take the train to go get our sword. And we need a few more things for our wonder weapon too. Okay, we're heading to waterfront district. Oh, right there. We have two arrows and a dick with two sets of balls. I'm gonna take a picture just in case. Okay, that means it's gonna be on this side, I think. It's gonna be right over here. One arrow. All right, so we got Two arrows with a, a dick and two balls, and then two arrows, or just an arrow. I don't remember. Good thing I took a picture. Well, while we're here, might as well start looking for the fuses. There's one. And then we get the civil protector out here. All right, is this good to use now? It is. Let's hop on in. I gotta remember what side this thing's on. I'm scared that if I look to one side, it's gonna be on the other. Yeah, I missed it completely. Well, I guess I'll grab another fuse while I'm here. Where is it at? Found it. Oh, shit. 
Oh, you could probably go build the zombie shield while I'm waiting. Almost forgot about that. Let's put her together. And there we go. We got the zombie shield. And it actually has like a rocket boost too. We can do one of these. Pretty sick. All right. Now I just have to look this way. And it should be coming right up. Right there. Two arrows and a dick with one ball. Or one set of balls. That's the three I need. All right. Let's become the beast. And now we need double arrow. Which is this one right here. We need double arrow with one ball. And the one with two balls. Did we get it? I think so. Why didn't it open? Okay, maybe we did it wrong. Yeah, that is some fucked up shit. I did it wrong. Damn it. All right, well, I have to wait till next round to do it, I think. All right, let's try this again. So it's for sure this one. We need just a normal arrow and then double arrow with balls. There we go. Okay, I must have did it wrong the first time. Well, I definitely did it wrong, but I don't know which one I picked. I don't know one I picked that made it wrong, but let's go ahead and grab our egg and let's just start filling this one up. And the egg is full. Let's grab it. And while we're here, I'm going to go double pack my gun. Let's see what ammo mod we get. Uh-oh. Lots of zombies. Let's throw in our zombie blood. Yep. Get the fuck out of here. Give me my gun back. Okay, so we got fireworks. Uh, from what I've heard, or at least what Silky was telling me, he was trying to explain it to me. I don't think I quite got it. But when I shoot it, it has a chance to spawn like another gun that shoots or something. Something similar to that. Like some Borderlands ass shit. But I need some more ammo for this. I think double packing should give you full ammo. But I mean, what do I know? Let's craft our wonder weapon real quick if we have time. Please. There we go. Thank you, Shield, for saving me. And there you go, Wonder Weapon. Get some, get a few kills there so I can get out of here. We need to get the little anal bead from this guy. Thank you. And let's start up this ritual. Especially while we have an insta-kill going. Fuck yeah. Everybody get in there. Easiest ritual of my life. There we go. He's dead. And I think this ritual is complete. Let's move on to the next one. And I'll start it. Oh, what's up, Margua? Ah, uh, and got insta-killed. Let's go. Shot it while his heads were open. Oh, wait, we have two Marguas. I forgot about that. Oh, well. Still gonna die all the same. Damn, I just got lit up running through there. And I'm down. Shit. Well, there goes that ritual attempt, and I need to get all my perks back. At least I have 9,000. I can get at least some of them back pretty easy. Come back to me, Jug. Oh, shit. That's game. Fuck! All right, well, but uh, I guess I'll see you guys when I have the sword back. All right, we're back. I'm getting my sword back. Bring that bad boy here. Now let's try to upgrade it. It's a lot lower of a round now, I think, than last time. So hopefully we can do it. But I'm going to go do the one by uh, the water, the boxing one first. All right, let's do this one and get it out of the way. Let's go ahead and spawn in Marguas. Fuck up its heads while they're all open. And Marguas down. All right, we got the most difficult one done. Let's go and try to get the rest. Hopefully we don't die before we do that. But I think we're on a pretty good run, knock on wood. Because the second I start getting cocky, the second I die. I guess we'll do this one since it's the closest. Oh, what's up, Margua? Open those mouths. Let me see those pearly whites. Get fucked up. Oh, there's two of you. Is there three Marguas? What the fuck? Why are there three of you? All right, well, the second I started talking shit, I went immediately down. Okay, running right for Jug. Not gonna die after grabbing Jug again. Ain't gonna happen. We're actually just gonna anywhere but here. Nice. I'll take that. Not a bad spawn. Yeah, you know, I'll just see you guys when we get our perks back, unless I die. All right, everything's back. Let's go start the ritual. Come on, Marguas. Open those mouths. Let me see them teeth. There we go. Nice and easy. Yeah, open up, open up. There we go. Nice. Did we just kill them both at the same time? There we go. Placing it. Okay, already broke some domes on some. We just gotta keep it moving. There we go. Nice and easy. Two domes on each. I really don't like training here, though. Oh, shit. I'm not about to get trapped up here. It's not happening. Oh, clear the breeze. We're out. Are they both dead? Did I get them? I think I might have done it. Yeah, I don't see the Margua anywhere. Go ahead, spawn in. Where you going, bug? Get down here. Where are these bugs flying to? All well, these bugs keep spawning, but just flying away. One of them's got to have my part, right? All right, now let's see if we can upgrade it. I think we did them all. What? Is it already upgraded? Yeah, this doesn't look upgraded to me. I got to be missing one. Oh, there's one right here that I didn't do. Rip. We still got one to go. All right, let's start her up. Shoot in the mouth. All the mouths. That's one down. One more to go. I think they're both dead. Nope, that one still has one more head. Damn it. There you go. Go ahead and go to sleep. Now our thing should be upgraded. Let's look at it. Nope, still normal. Do we have to go back and upgrade it? We can still slice some zombies up in the meantime. This thing's still kind of nasty. Oh, I never brought it back to him. I'm an idiot. There you go. Thank you. Upgrade my sword, please. Thank you. There we go. The reborn sword. That's what I was forgetting to do. I'm an idiot. All right. Well, we got everything besides the wonder weapon. So I'm going to work towards that. Let's go see if I have any little nipples on the ground that want to give me my part. Does this little nipple have it? Nope. It has a bug that just flew right away. I don't know where these bugs are flying to and why they keep doing that. That's going to be a problem trying to get my other part. 
Maybe I'll get it from the box. I'll even take a ray gun, maybe. Nope, a locust. It's going to be right here, though. Easy part. Nope, that's a grenade. I don't think I've checked the uh, little nipples down here in a while. Yeah, this one's purple. It's ready to give me my part. Nope, mana war. This is stupid. I guess while I'm down here, I'll grab the bowie knife. Still don't understand why there's not galvan knuckles in here. Missed opportunity. Oh, I guess it's kind of like, I don't know, there, there's brass knuckles on there. I guess it's a combination of the two, but it's no galvan knuckles. This one's ready to pop. Please have my part. No, it's got a bug that's flying the fuck away. Seems like they're working on this round. Oh, drop the Xenomatter. Let's go. We just need to find our tentacle part somehow. This is the quest for the wonder weapon now. This one's ready to go. Please have it. Oh, a fire sale. And I'm down. I literally just went down for a fire sale. Fucking idiot, dude. Okay, well, quick revive's gone. Are there any pods down here? There has to be, right? Oh, there is right here in this corner. All right, sword time, baby. Everybody get back. I think that's my thing. I think that's what I need. There we go. We got it. We got it. Woo! Finally. That was close. I almost died back there. All right. Let's go craft this. Damn. No. That's the game. No. All right. Well, we got it. We got it last time. We were really right next to the bench. I can see the bench. And we're about to make it. Whatever. I'm done. But uh, overall review of Shadows of Evil. I like this map a lot. I think this was a good intro to BO3. I'm glad I took the extra time to learn it and, you know, the extra days to play it get used to not only the map but bo3 as a whole you know learning stuff about gobble gums i i think i kind of got this game down at least like i know what to do i might not be the greatest at it but i kind of know what i'm doing now anyways this is an amazing map i love it i'll probably go back to it i think we're probably gonna go do the easter egg with like silky and some of the other boys so i'll uh, be on the lookout for that but with that i'm gonna end the video here so if you guys like this and you want to see more go ahead and leave a like on it if you didn't and you don't dislike if you're new here please start subscribing put out all kinds of cod content throughout the week that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.